You're Hawkeye. Here is the drawbridge. Charlie Jones a little um, skinky. <laughs> Can't feel right at home here. Yeah, I thought you would. <laughs> this one has papers over the window. I don't think they're new. They're remodeling. Yeah. Like it's said, they're closed due to the COVID. And a lot of these eateries are closed down in shops. Right, man, today is August 13th. Happens to be a Friday. Happy Friday the 13th. We're in a place called Charleston, Oregon. And uh, found this little place called Snug Harbor RV Park, which is behind a gift shop and a laundromat. <laughs> Last night when we went to bed, this place was full of water. Here is our campsite. Yeah, it's kind of a small place. Did I tell you we're downtown Charleston? That's CNN there. They just had a story about all the chatter they're hearing on the internet regarding another insurrection. I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens. It's a little later in the morning here. I guess I just wanted to photograph how much the tide's coming in, you know. A bunch of people out there, I guess, walking around in the mud, uh, digging for clams. Since the last recording of the situation here, but as you can see, the tide is going out again. Okay, tape's rolling. 60 degrees. 63 is the outside temperature. Good job. There's an old timer who lives over there in that old bus. He's out here taking care of these plants earlier. Across the street, we have the old general store. We'll have groceries and liquor. Yeah, that David Jones locker is just another quick store. Really? This is where all the... I thought it said deli. Oh, it is? Yeah, but it's like a liquor store. trying to get out. <laughs> oh, wow, this is a dead end here. Oh boy, you got yourself in this one, didn't you? <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, I'm going to do this back in right there.
Actually, this guy's been here for a while. He's got his own fencing. He didn't have to bother with the fence. She could have just opened it in the cage. They might have a vacancy right here for us. You think? Close to the road? Nice. This might be restrooms there. Why do I think this guy on this scooter probably resides here? <laughs> How you doing? How are you doing? Come and ride along with Hawkeye and Jeannie on their trip, visiting cities, communities, towns, villages, hot springs, Timbuktu, a few nudist resorts, and some other places of interest to determine what is really going on during the aftermath of the COVID-19 pandemic. Hawkeye and Jeannie are a couple of old hippies who are still having fun as if it was 1969, then they report back to you with these videos. That is what Hawkeye's Tales and Trails is all about. Okay. Episode 77 is about Charlie Town, oh boy. I mean Charleston. All information is deemed to be reliable however there is no guarantee that it could be. Charleston is an unincorporated community in Coos County, in the state of Oregon of the United States located in North America. Charleston is the least populated community, with a population of 795 in 2017. Charlie Town in Oregon's Bay Area, and is home to a large commercial fishing fleet, it is adjacent to the ocean entrance to Coos Bay. Charleston is the site of the Oregon Institute of Marine Biology, and the United States Coast Guard Charleston Lifeboat Station. See all those Dodge Rams back there? Yeah, I can bet you. Here you see the Jimmy's Ford. Here's all the Fords. Chevy. <laughs> These are all American made, man. American made. Ah, right. uh, there's a Toyota. Go. Charleston was named for Charles Haskell, a settler who filed a land claim along South Slough in 1853. South Slough is an arm of Coos Bay, which it enters near the bay's mouth on the Pacific Ocean. Oregon Route 540, which crosses the slough southwest of Barview, passes through Charleston, and links it to three state parks further south along the coast, Sunset Bay, Shore Acres, and Cape Arago. Postal authorities established a post office in Charleston in 1924. The community's zip code is 97420, but then who really cares? The South Slough National Estuarine Research Reserve, a 4,770-acre reserve along the Coos Bay Estuary, was established in Charleston in 1974. It was the first of 28 such reserves in the United States, and the only one in Oregon. Now what do you think about that? Can you believe it? Thanks for watching. Hawkeye's expectation is to show places and events that you may not normally get to see, here and how the COVID-19 pandemic may have affected them. Click on the round icon to subscribe and be notified when new episodes are available to be viewed. Share the video with others. Please click the like or the thumbs up icon. We need 1000 subscribers and he still has a long way to go. Hawkeye's videos are amateur, unscripted documentaries of Hawkeye and Jeannie's journey and discoveries. It is our recommendation that if you are new to Hawkeye's Tales and Trails, start with episode one. Can you believe it? Now, what do you think about that? I think that I may have already seen the movie. Or was it on the news? I am Calithia, the host of Hawkeye's Tales and Trails. Be positive 